um, if you put me sitting next to Ro, um, that person will be very happy for that. I know. And I can't tell who that, who that person is lying to. Are they lying to me or are they lying to you? Because in that situation, if, you know, the noms stay the same, because I have had, like, Ty and Jed have both told me, like, that there's a chance that I could go up, but that they really don't think that I'm the target, which feels nice. That feels Tara, great. But that, the eyes? Yeah. No. Yeah. If you go home this week, that is completely out of my control, and I don't know what happened. Yeah. I'm worried that this person that we want to say, we don't have to say name. We know, right? We're <laughs> yes. agreeing on the same person. Yes. Um, I just don't know what she would do or what she would say or what she, she would She hasn't say. come and talked to me yet. Yeah. Are you feels... aware of how strong she is? What do you mean? In this game. Oh, yes. Yes. That in a final two situation, nobody is winning against her. <laughs> Honestly? Nobody. In every final two situation, unless I start doing something, I win against no one. Do you know what I mean? I am, for some reason, I'm the most talked about in this house. I have won nothing. Like, it's because you're easy. Yeah, I, I but that's easy what for you to go thinks. up. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? But Tara, like, in what way would it benefit me? I for don't you think to go it, home? it would. In what way? It wouldn't. In what kind of move is that? Yeah. It's the, it would be such an easy HOH. It would be, ugh. Yeah. It's silly. It'd be a silly week. Yeah. I don't want you to go home this week, Tara. Yeah. I'm serious. And whatever you're hearing, Please don't believe it. Yeah. The guys, uh, like, they're the closest ones to me. They literally don't say anything about you. Yeah. And I do, I do believe that. Please do. Yeah. And that's all I can say to you. Yeah. That's all I can say. And I saw it yesterday when I won, and I was like, something's up. And I don't know well, why. Well, just because I knew... Okay. The reason my reaction was the way that it was, I was very hesitant. I didn't want to necessarily keep Brayden, only for the reason that I know nobody will say his name. I can't see you saying Brayden's name. I won't. I'm going to be straight with you. Yeah. No. So Brayden that means that you're going to say mine. You're not because gonna say numbers. You're not going to say Tina's. You're not going to say Kiefer's. And I don't know if you would actually say the name that we are alluding at. You could prove me wrong. I don't know. And that's why I was not upset. I'm happy for you. You deserve to win. That was a really hard comp. I'm excited you got to like see your family and like you have this. That was my only hesitation with keeping mm -hmm. Brayden is that I know he, people won't say his name. But it, also in that regard, to me, he's a safer pawn than me going up. That's how yeah. I feel. And I see where you're coming he from, is for not, sure. Nobody's going to vote out Brayden. No. It's not going to happen. Whoever sits next to Brayden is 1,000% going home. And because I have been that. talked so poorly about from the get-go, things that are out of my control... I don't know if that's the same for me. Do you know what I mean? But you sit next to Roe. It's not you, Tara. You're not a threat. Could, yeah. You're not a threat in this game. Yeah. As of right now, you're not. And I'm sorry if that's rude. You're just no, not. No, as of right now, but until people start really talking shit, do you know what I mean? And they know that I won't, because I've said I haven't wanted to go into the game like that, being catty in that way, like that's not my, it's not my, it's just not the way I want to play my no, game. No, and I love that about you. That's yeah. why I, I, it's a big reason why I want you to stay. But it will be hard because I have heard lots of people say a lot of things about me that are not true. Me too. I think that's everybody, girl. Yeah. It's everybody. Can I ask? Please. If Ro is your target, why you brought him to Wendy's and not me? Ro is almost impossible to get anything out of that guy. Yeah. He's very vague. You and I actually have decent conversations. Yeah. If I were to sit you down on Expedia, I think you'd be open with me. For sure. Ro wouldn't. Right. I needed to bribe him. Yeah. Straight up. Because to me, that almost looks like if he is the target and I'm going up, is everybody lying to me? Do you I know what I mean? you're going to think that, Tara. You're going to yeah. think it. Yeah. I'm going to be straight with you. Straight up, I don't want you to go home this week. Yeah. At all. But I'm going to go up. You're going to go on the block. I'm not going to say anything more. Yeah. Know that everything you're telling me is unbelievable. Yeah. Please trust me. Yeah. And I hope that just going on the block isn't going to ruin our relationship. I know yeah. it's obviously a kick in the ass, 
but I hope you see what happens. Yeah. And I hope it works out. And I, this is the thing also is, like I didn't want to just put, like, I, I hope it shows that you're not my target and I don't want to split a duo up that I'm not putting you up next to Tina. Yeah. Like, that'll never be an option. Yeah, what if Ro, like, com what if Ro comes down? If Ro comes down, then you will see. Yeah. Would you put up Tina next to me if no. Ro comes down? No. Okay. Because that's when I will feel like that I am your yeah. target. Do oh, you know and guaranteed. I mean? And then you can tell everyone in the house I'm a liar. Yeah. Right then and there. Yeah. Tina's not going on the block this week. All right. Does that help a little bit? Yeah. Like, I'm in a position where I just kind of have to trust you. Like, I would be lying if it's... You're scared, obviously. Well, it's just like, I, I feel like I have, like, two weeks in a row gone against my gut to stick with you guys to prove my trust when I could have pushed those issues and I didn't. So I would be lying if I didn't feel sketchy right now. In both I do of get that. In However, both we did those... have the numbers anyways. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like voting with the house is just There safety. were people that were very flippy floppy with those numbers. And yeah. if I wanted to press them a little more, I could have. Mm -hmm. There were people that were teetering. And I very specifically did not. In fact, the only people that I discussed real options with were the three of you. Do you know what I mean? Like you and Jed outside, and I did briefly talk about it with Ty. Mm -hmm. I did not really press the issue. No, and we all kept that between us too. Yeah. So a part of me would feel very foolish if that was the wrong call for me. Do you know what I mean? Are you suggesting I just, that I just straight up put this person on the block? It's also your, this is your game. It's your decision. I just, I just don't want a situation, Tara. Let's just be straight. If it gets out of this room, I'll know it was you. Who yeah, yeah, yeah. If it gets to the, if, if I put her right on the block and she yeah. takes herself off, you're the replacement nominee. And then it's way more, way more sketch. So my only issue of winning that veto is if, and this is me playing devil's eye, because we know who we're talking about. Okay, we know who we're talking about. We're talking about you. Yeah, if you put up me and Ro, she has talked about you to me, but she also very openly talks about pairs and how she does not like pairs. She does not like your trio, but she does not like pairs either. This is why I can't figure out where she's gunning. So if you put me sitting next to Ro, she gets picked for veto and wins and takes Ro down you are kind of forced then to That's put the up Tina. One. That's the scariest one. 100%. That is literally and the worst case scenario. And that is very possible. Mm -hmm. But I understand why you don't want to put her up because she'll go crazy. But if she goes crazy, she is just an even bigger target if she comes down the next week. And I don't want her to go crazy, Tara, because I also don't want your game to get blown up. And it will. Yeah. The second that she starts blowing this place up, it's going to get out. Well, oh, I was telling Tara this stuff, and now it's getting back to Beth. Yeah, but if we all know that it's kind of BS, I don't know. That's just my, because I could see that scenario very easily playing out. Yeah. I really. And then in that situation, it. you guys are stuck with Ro and Vic left right before a double. Mm -hmm. And I have told both. Or maybe it was just Jed. I don't know if I've told Ty. If you don't put me on the block, I promise I will not say any of your three names next week. Any of them. I won't say that. Because there will be, like, another one left. And for me, I would use Brayden as a pawn. Mm -hmm. It's just something to consider. No, that's huge. Because it is... She is strong if she got picked and she wanted to really shake things up, that could happen. The nice thing is, is that she feels so safe this week. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, she feels so really- So safe. Yeah, she feels that safe. That if maybe if one of the guys also got picked, like I would tell her, like, can you throw it? Give it to one of the guys. Beth, please fix yeah. your microphone. Right, she feels yeah. so safe. This cannot leave this room. It's not going to. What do I, I have nothing to, like, <laughs> my ass is probably going up on the block. It's not in my interest if that is actually what you were thinking to say anything about it. If anything, I need to look like I'm going on the block and I'm worried that I think that you're my, that I'm your target. That's how I need to make it look. 
that's just like my biggest worry. Yeah. And then your HOH is wasted and it I will waste. go home and you know I'm not gunning for you. I said it weeks ago. And I know you meant it I, and I hope that you know that I am meaning I kind too. of need you in this game, especially if I get further. Same. Because there will come a time that you're going to need somebody on the other side to start making moves that you are not physically able to make. 100%. And that's obviously down the road. But we need to start thinking about that shit. Yeah. You are valuable to me for sure. And you are valuable to me. So it definitely puts it in a predicament because depending on how you play it, because you know if I'm sitting next to Tina, I'm going home. Yes, I do know that. People, Tina's most likely going, in, in a lot of she's final going. two situations, she's sitting in final two mm -hmm. with a lot of people. You know. It's a big week and I want it to be. Mm -hmm. But it can't be if it gets out. Yeah. And if she does get picked, I got to continue just to feed it to her that. What did you tell Ro? Ro was kind of wondering what kind of move I'm going to make. Mm -hmm. I was very honest with him, like, you're going to go up. Yeah. That's how I'm playing. I want everyone to know where I'm at. Um, and he just said, I guessed it. I know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think he knows he's going up. He said, I'm an easy one, and I know that I can. But I told him, like, please gun for it. Yeah. You'll see what you see, and that's about it. Yeah. Like, if you got house guest choice, who would you pick? If it's me up there, me against Ro. I probably wouldn't pick Tina because I want someone to win it mm -hmm. who can. Yeah. You know, I mean, of course, Tina can win things. I just want more guarantee. Mm -hmm. Probably Jed. Yeah. I know he's going to have a huge part in, like, what I want to do as yeah. well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Getting VO'd is one of the scariest things in the entire world, though. <laughs> and nobody another wants to do it, one. but we'll fucking no. do it. Well, and another thing to consider, we don't know if we're in jury yet. And that's not a bad thing not to have her in there. This is what I mean, Tara, we're on the same page. Yeah. Please, like, as for the personal stuff, I don't know what that shit is. Yeah. I'm kind of just getting over, <laughs> I don't know, I hear it all the time that you guys are, like, really, like, that that I don't deserve heart, to be here. It literally breaks my heart. Yeah. 100%. It's not true. Yeah. yeah. I hope it's not. <laughs> you know? And that's all you can see. And, like, when you rewatch, like, you'll be like, oh, but no, none of that stuff happened. Yeah. There's very few people who are playing dirty games in here. Yeah. I think we're all playing, like, pretty awesome games. And it's starting to come out. Yeah. And I'm not down. Yeah, no. And I'm not down for the girls against girls. No. Ever. No. Like, I honestly was even a little bit offended that you went to Jed and Ty first, because I was like... I didn't really? go to them first. They actually... Like, Did they approach you? Well, me and Tina were going to play chess, and Ty was just in there. Okay. And then me and Tina were playing chess, and Jed came in. That one I did see. I um, was like, hmm, like I... Come, yeah. Yeah. And, and then, like, like, I, I just, even I, I told you yesterday, like, I wanted to talk to you. But we were like, oh, I'm tired. So no, yeah. it was too tired, and like... I would have, wouldn't even remembered. Well, no, it's like... I want to let people enjoy their moments. Yeah. It's an exciting moment for you. Like, in your moment, do you really care how I'm feeling and that I'm uncomfortable? No. Enjoy your moment. I haven't ran up to a single HOH room since we started having the... I've never done it. Like, instantly, you mean? I've never done it. No, me neither. Wait till the next day. I have come into the HOH rooms after they've seen their room, they've been with their people. I've never hung out in somebody's HOH like crazy. Even when Keith won HOH, I didn't run up to his room right away. No. I haven't I do, done I can't that. do the fakeness. It's not even fakeness. It's like I want to let people enjoy their moments. Mm -hmm. That's all there is to it. Yeah. And I haven't, like... You generally have not, no. Yeah. Like, the only person that I'd, like, maybe if Tina won it. Like, I'd be like, yeah, you know what I mean? But, like... Well, that's just a given, though. Like, yeah. You're her people. Yeah, so that's yeah, different. yeah. Just because I'd be, like, so stoked for, like, her moment. But, like, I just... 
Like, you're not going to find me, like, hanging out in here all week. I'm not going to bug you. This is the one conversation we need to have. And I love that. That's what I loved about Toya, yeah. too. Like, I'm not going to... I won't say anything about your plan. I'm obviously... It I would anybody. I would be lying if I wasn't nervous. Of course not. Because I have been trying to build trust, so obviously I'm nervous. But I I'll know. just have to see what happens with it. You know what I mean? And if I go home... Then my gut was wrong about you guys. Mm -hmm. That's all it would be. If I go home, my gut was I wrong. I know, and I don't even want to talk about that because yeah. it's not. Yeah. It's not what I need out of this week. It's be it'd be shit for my game. It'd be shit for my resume. Yeah. yeah. My thing is, is that if we want to do this as a house, we need to stick together. Yeah. Oh yeah. A lot of shit's gonna be said about you, about Tina, about me, about Jen, about Ty, about like everybody. Oh, everybody. We need to stick together. Yeah. No, one hundred percent. One hundred percent. Okay. I'm used to people talking shit. Same, man. I just don't understand why. It's just that's the only part that frustrates me. Is like I don't. I don't understand why. Yeah. Like, I've very openly told everybody that I'm not, I don't want to play a game where I'm throwing people under the bus and being scandalous. And you would obviously have to know it because if I wanted to be playing that game, you would have already heard me say things like this before. Mm -hmm. The only thing I've ever done is discuss options. I do, look at, I do look at options. But for some reason, my name comes out all of the time as this big shit talker. And I don't get it. Like, it's just, it's getting frustrating, mm -hmm. you know? I know, Tara. There's but I know, like, I'm in a position where, like, I can't say anything, and I won't. I'm just frustrated. Because that, honestly, once you because do, you would know it will if just it kick was you true. in the ass, and then I'll you be like, would well. know, You would know if it was true. Okay, let's just call a spade a spade here. Has the person that we are talking about talk shit about me to you? Yes. And has said, you have been dragging me through yes. this game. And then if you win, it's me. And have I Personal things said about what's anything going on with us, about boys. this person to you yet? And vice versa. Exactly. And I know that. I think that's where we can confirm. I know that. I feel like me and you are actually very similar people. Yeah. And there's no reason that we would be involved in any of that shit. I would just hope that she doesn't get picked to play. Because if she does, I do think she would take role. I do. It's a bad situation. And I actually, like, I do want to say, like, it fucking sucks that I have to put you up. Like, yeah. I wish I had more options, Tara. That's why I'm like, I really hope this doesn't break what we have. Yeah. I did, I straight up, even with how close me and Braden are, I considered him because he stays calm. Yeah. And he doesn't react. Yeah. Like, that's still there. I might have a conversation with him. Yeah. But if it is you, like, please, please stay calm, okay? Yeah. Probably sounds like I'm running your tires and I'm just gonna... No, no, it's just like, but... it's like... Maybe I should have played a more intimidating game. Because when you do play calm and you don't talk shit, you get put up anyway, <laughs> do you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, people are scared to say her name for that reason. I know. She's going to make it far, though, because people are afraid of her. But I'm not. But even the boys were like, whoa, you, you're thinking of that? I'm like, yeah. Yeah. And then it was confirmed with what you're saying right now. Yeah. Well, and I mean, I'm like 90% sure she has that slot pass. I didn't get it. Me too. She didn't volunteer for you. So that's the part that's frustrating. You know, like, I'm on slop, I'm on the block. Everybody keeps telling me that that's where they're going. And she's just, like, eating food, laughing at us. That bothers me. Bothers me, too. She's in a good spot. Where she yeah. thinks she is. This is really sick that we're on the same page, because I didn't think anybody was, and I didn't think I'd be able to say her name for a long, long time. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, no. She's a scary name to say. Yeah. You agree? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should have played a scarier game. I think because people 
I don't know. I think that but I'm you gotta soft. Be yourself. I say that too, but then how do you play? I don't know. Yeah. You play the game that you're just, it comes natural, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So what do you want me to be? She's going to ask me what you said. Yeah, and just say, yeah, she told me it's me. Yeah. And that I think that is that, how I've been playing too. And then Straight. do you want me to say that I think your target is row? Yeah. Okay. That's yeah, what that's I'll good. Say. And I will probably say, she told me her target is row, but I honestly don't know. It could be me. And then you can see where she feeds you. Because then she'll feel really comfortable. Yes. I'll say I had a decent talk with her. She told me I'm going up. The target is row. It could be me, I don't Be a little down. Yeah. I hope, I hope you believe me. Yeah. I could as even, much as you can. Yeah, I could even say if we want to keep her very comfortable so she doesn't feel like she has to come for the veto. Like, I'd be like, my worst case is Ro saves himself. She would put up Brayden as a pawn and I go home. This is why I'm upset. Yeah, 100%. It's all, all the scenarios. Yeah. All right. Now I'm going to go make a crepe. Maybe this is your veto to win. Yeah, that would be awesome. I'd be pretty stoked for that. I'm obviously nervous to go up against the veto king. Now he's one, too. More than me. <laughs> More than anyone. Yeah. Don't be hard on yourself, eh? Okay? Yeah. In that situation, if Jed won, is he taking off Ro or is he taking off me? I need to talk to him about it. But he's got to use that on somebody. Yeah. Maybe to build trust with you and to really let you know. Yeah. But I'm going to ask him. Yeah. Because obviously, like, this is what I respect about, like, him and I working together is, like, he's not in here being like, this is what needs to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, when he wins shit, I'm not going to say that to him either. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, yeah. we're playing the same uh, together. It's the, I would say it's like just like you and Tina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do you, but I have your back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to go make a crepe. I'm glad we chit chatted. And I'm glad I can be honest with you, Kara. Yeah. Personal stuff, please just shove it away because it's not real. Yeah. I'm here to play a game. Not Is there a reason why down. it would be me and not Tina? Can I just ask that? I don't even know. Yeah. I literally don't know. I think because the entire of house the has just assumed. Everybody has just assumed that it's me. I've never heard anybody say her name. Ever. And she's the only. Do you think it's only... safer to put her up? Hmm? Do you think it's safer? No, I was just generally wondering. I why, think just because I've been why that... hearing you say my name. Yeah, now you're but confirming it's like. It's not it's true. The, that's like basically like the only person that I'm usually with the most and I only ever hear my name mm -hmm. so I don't know how I'm always in all these conversations do you know what I mean if everybody's always like it's Tara and Tina together I've just wondered straight that. up I think it's like when you guys come and have conversations with people you do the talking yeah Tina's like yep I agree yep I agree maybe that's why okay for me it's only because I was like oh Tara's saying my name but now you've confirmed that you haven't been no 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 no, so I could actually really think about that. Uh, no, it's you, not like you. Yeah, can yeah, yeah. Like, no, don't yeah. Think that, but. You don't. You don't have to. I've just. I've just been very curious to why I just hear my name all of the time. Yeah. That, that was just like pure like. And straight up, Tara. Like you come up with good things. Like you coming outside and being like Austin this, Austin that. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh shit. Like that's good. Yeah. Like you come up with good stuff. Mm -hmm. Don't think you're a weak player. Yeah. Paris fucking won this game and she won one competition at the very end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? Don't be hard on yourself. They're playing a really good social game too. I'm not, like, you're not, my, again, you're not making Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 like, it is. It's just like, I've just, like, I haven't, I just don't know how I've gotten into so many of these. It's annoying as fuck. I know. I'm a constant butt of a joke. Like, I get it. You yeah. know, like, we are constantly, but yeah. strong ass women. Yes. We are. Right? Like, I think it's awesome. Yeah, and I'm, don't want to be pinned against you. That's just and so, I'm glad we cleared it up. And we so know lame. It's like the last. No, 
And me and you are so rational that I couldn't see us having like a lame blow up or anything. Like no, that. no, I don't want to be in. Are you kidding? No, I can't be in a cat fight situation. I have a no, daughter. I have a daughter. I have a, I no, have a I can't daughter. Do like, like, it's not the look. It's not the look. All right. Well, I'm glad we chatted. Me too. We're in. We're in for a hug. Yeah. We'll figure it out. You will love. Um, but that is what I'm gonna say. That you just told me that it's row. And just be a little down. Yeah. Yep. 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 Hey, I can nail that. I didn't leave my water bottle in here, right? No. Okay. Oh, yes! Do you have one? Uh, yes, I do. I have one, and so do you. <laughs> well, do yeah. I? Yes! What? I was like, we're having this fun night, us girls. Yes. Shut the fuck up. You saw these and I did it. I have uh, an anti aging uh. one and I'm like, I'm just getting old and ugly. Firming. <laughs> Hydrate. Fuck you're yes. Get your basket up. I'm like, I didn't get any of this. Wait, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> what hold are you on. doing? I'm going to come up with you. Yeah, I'm going to fuck off. Um, the boys are playing chess and then he's playing Brayden and it's very hot in there though. Okay. I'm freezing. Huh? Actually, I got to pee. Mm. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Like my 
girl. That was Brock. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. She told what? me. I didn't even think about the video. I fucking missed it folding laundry. Oh, yeah. What was said? Tell me the whole video that you were. It was my best friend, Brock. She, they, everyone has shirts with big, my sunflowers are my favorite. Everyone has shirts with sunflowers. Oh, they have t shirts? Oh, it's this Big Brother Canada 9, Team Beth. Oh, oh my god. god. And then my best friend, Jen, had a baby girl. Named her Beth, no, I'm gonna. Yeah. <laughs> Named her Big Brother. <laughs> oh. oh so my parents shocked into beer when I won HOH last night. Stop. <laughs> You're winning! I am stressed. You got a good brain though. Right next to me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> right next to me. It's the puzzle map. What? <laughs> Does one puzzle <laughs> ever? Last it's time I did a puzzle, I was like 14. Nine. How are you? You clearly remember a lot from your childhood. How are you? <laughs> good. Huh? Do I move my queen? She's so hot, I wish you just saw her. Oh, yeah. Where do you want to move her? Oh, yeah. Start moving her down the board. To where and what? Mm. I'm just moving mindlessly, you know? Uh, you certain is it? Oh. Uh, <laughs> would it be from? <laughs> nope. Tie bar then. No way. What are you coming for, huh? Oh yeah. Okay, okay, okay. What is there to do? What are they doing back there? In the backyard? I feel a little nervous. Huh? A little anxious. Yeah, like what's happening? We got there's nothing. We're like... Great. Crazy. We're like we're deep crazy. in the floor. It's a oh. filthy backyard. It's just they're really having a tough time with those boots. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it is. Awesome. <laughs> mm -hmm. Brady, you can checkmate him in two moves. Can he actually? Yeah. Checkmate. Braden could win this game in two moves. Oh, yeah, I get it. Low key. Not low key. Low key, high key, low key. Bum, bum, bum. Hey, boy. <laughs> okay. I like that. I like that. I don't know how to make them flip. Anyone in the pantry? I don't think so. Well, how's it going? How'd it go? Oh, she just told me I'm going up. Which I would not surprise by. Well, you're not her target. Yeah, I still think there's a very good chance I go home. Tara, <laughs> there's no way. I'm telling you, there's no way. If Vic plays in POV, and if she wins, she will take down Rome. <laughs> 
There's no chance. I guarantee it. How? Because she's still going to want to take a shot at them. And she knows Rose better for her odds. There's no chance. I'm just saying, if it happens. That is the most unlikely thing I've ever heard in my life. Nick is gunning for them. <sighs> There's no way there of it. In a million years, that doesn't happen. I'm telling you. Until it happens. There's no way. I'd self evict if that happened. I'll tell you that right now, right before. Then nobody goes home. I'm out. It was a waste of age, right? It's not gonna, it's not gonna happen like that. You can't be sure of that. I am sure of that. You would be pissed, Tina would be pissed, Ty and Jed would be pissed, Beth would be pissed. Why would they wanna go against the house? Brayden would be pissed. The whole house would be pissed. It would literally be her and Rohan against the world. And she's still mad at Rohan for throwing her name under the bus. She's, I was just talking about her. She thinks Rohan's whole pitch was to put her up on the block. <laughs> to me, that's the most unlikely thing. I don't know. I, I'm not going to feel comfortable unless I win. That's just bottom line. Just win. Win it. Tomorrow's a big day. Whatever she told Ro, he's going up. She did. At Wendy's. That's pretty savage. I think it's more savage that. Can, how do I flip this without wrecking it? You have to keep, you have to let it sit. Well, I think Come it's on. ready, but it's really big. You wanna do this for me? Can you try doing a little flippy thing? Yeah, sure. Oh, oh boy. now you fucked it up. No, I didn't, that's good. See, it's good. Okay, now I fucked it up. How can we fix it? Lift. Yeah, now it's all fucked up. Yeah, I fucked that up bad. Here, give it back. Give it back. Yeah, you fucked it up. You fucked it up. This one, I would chop it in half. Oh. What's more savage? you take me to Wendy's? Because you're more likely to give up information. What? You're more likely to just give up information than Rolf. No, no, I definitely don't feel comfortable. You should never feel comfortable on the block. But you're not even on the block yet. Oh, I'm going, she told me. Yeah. Just trust how oh, we got ya. Once I hit that block, I'm never gonna stop hitting it. I'll get put up every week. You know this. Not unless me or Tina win. That's big brother, man. He signed up for this bullshit game. I told you, you can't complain until you've been on the block more than me. Hmm? You can't complain until you've been on the block more than me. And I went up when there were options. <laughs> I just don't see any scenario where I actually win or even make it to final two. Me neither. For me. But again, we signed up for the experience. Sucks. 
never know. Tina and I can go on this crazy winning streak. Yeah, maybe. Very unlikely. Yeah. Did you think you're gonna win? Hmm. You still have a champ. You have a one in nine champ. It's better than one in fourteen. I don't think anybody would bring me. Why not? They would bring anybody with pick Tina over me for final two. Anybody. Canada's fave. Never touched the block. I don't know. I don't know. I just have to get through this week. I'm just like, I'm just discouraged. Yeah, I know the feeling. You'll be I though. We'll be laughing this time next Friday. It just shows like that they, that people don't really care about me at all in this house. How so? Not you. Yeah. They're scared to make it big angry. They don't care if they make me angry. Yeah. We just don't get angry. I would just go up with them next week anyway. Do you know what I mean? Mm, you wouldn't go home in a double. I don't think the double's next week. I actually don't think the next person that goes is going to be in the jury. I think it might be six and Canada. That would make sense, especially with COVID. Smaller quarantine numbers. Mm hmm Well, I mean, once you're in the jury house and you don't leave, I don't think the numbers matter too much. Especially if we can all travel together. Um, I just don't know. I don't know if this is going to be good. This looks weird. The only reason why it's like... Because sometimes there's that five people rule. They might want to be closer to that than further away. Mm. I think there is a good chance that whoever goes this week might not be in jury. It's not guaranteed. It won't be you. I hope not. It won't. <laughs> Unless there's some crazy magical power that keeps... Everybody's safe besides you? Who ever since the next year has gone home? Not if Tina does. Tina will not touch the block. What if Vic wanted to just wreak havoc? She wouldn't. You don't think so? No, she's working with her injured. She wants to be back. You know what I mean? Beth wants to take her out. That's even a scary scenario to talk about out loud. Yeah. But I think Beth would. In fact, I know she would. And I like Vic, and I don't want to see her go. I'd rather see Rohan go before her. Yeah. Because I don't really like Rohan. <laughs> really? I thought yeah. you did. Oh. <laughs> it might look like we're best friends, but... No. All you need to do is just stay calm. Continue with the pitch of if I'm better for your game, just keep me here. I want to be here. I deserve to be here. I don't deserve to be here any less than anybody else. Why is everybody saying that I don't deserve to be here? What do you mean you don't deserve to be here? Do you know how many times I've heard that? From who? Well, from Vic saying that those three. And I did hear that Austin said that as well, too, before she left. From and Kyle who? also told me that they have said that about me, that I don't deserve to be here. Why not? That I'm not playing a good game. You outlasted all those people. Yeah. What's a better game? I don't know. I don't know why everybody keeps telling me that. Well. And then telling them that I straight up, like, don't like Beth. I'm like, I don't like anybody. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> it's all an act. <laughs> Legit. I came here to play Big Brother. Sometimes you have to do shit you don't like.
you guys don't think I know what you're talking about this guy? Seriously, what'd you do with all my undies? Huh? What'd you do with all my undies? <laughs> They're in my bag. Take them home. <laughs> Trading a flannel for save, some undies? Save them for later. I am missing some undies, though. I swear to God, I didn't see any. I've They're... never said anything behind your back that I haven't said worse to your face. It's a true story, oh, I actually. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Way worse. Actually, behind, behind your back, I actually say nicer things. <laughs> <laughs> Growth actually not that bad. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Can you save your next goddamn speed stone? No. Fuck. It's gonna be more ruthless. Dude, I was shook. I was like, fuck. <laughs> Iconic. I think this is done. No. No? No. I don't want well it's a it's a pink it's supposed to be a crepe. I don't want it burnt. It's like sweet. I'm gonna put some sugar and syrup on it. Okay, well maybe it's done. I would say no though. It still looks mushy. I don't Are want you to making know. coffee, bro? I am. Do you want some? Yes, I do, please. Um, I, in all honesty, I don't know where your underwear are. <laughs> <laughs> they, weren't, they weren't in that thing? Did you, just, did you just not put them in? Is Bray and Ty still playing chess in there? Yeah. Is Bray good? Is he what? Is he good? or He's winning. He, He's he, he was, was winning. winning? He was winning. He was he is, winning. Yeah, he was winning at one point. No way. But I was helping. <laughs> Ty must have been shook. Anything I can do to help? Oh, you got syrup? We're gonna need to make more of those. It's okay, I can have some of this syrup. Hmm? I can have some of this syrup. Well, maybe they'll give us more. I don't know. They got it. You would think. Whose pasta is this? It's a lot. Just leftover. Should I wrap it up? Well, I'll probably toss. Toss it? Should I, or are you going to do it? Uh, if you want to. If you're going to do it, I'll just do it. Do it. Crazy. Trash it. It's been sitting out too long. I thought Ty was going to eat it. Well, if he asks, I'm saying, Kiefer yeah, said, just, uh, fuck you. Oh. Well. Happy to, BB. Happy to. It's midday Why, batteries about already? This again? Huh? It's midday batteries already? I will not forget about this a second time. Oh, okay. But I am making coffee. Game of hockey after this, Kiefer? Yeah, I did. Something to do, you know? Yeah. Wake up a bit? I know. Mm -hmm. Can't stop freaking you on Energy pumping, you know? Yeah. Break a sweat. I want a cup of coffee though. Are you in coffee, mate? Nice cup of Joe. Ah, uh, yeah, Ro made some. Rohan. 
He can give us them batteries. Hell, you know I want to shoot, baby. When you go back asking for more syrup, is there anything else we need for sauce? Uh, um, did we get cinnamon? Did we have extra cinnamon? Uh, I haven't been in the pantry, so I don't know about the pantry. Is there garlic salt there? Or what? Garlic salt or garlic, like just straight up garlic. Yeah. There's garlic powder. Yeah. Oh, yeah, garlic powder. That's yeah. what we get to use, right? How much? Should be a bit. Looks like it was just open, really. Yeah. Okay. It's an all speedy gallon. Actually. Big sauce in there, but like no more ketchup, mustard, mayo. Should I ask for that? I will just have yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. And syrup and cinnamon. Yep. Yes, please. You're gonna need it. Welcome. She just told me she put me up. She does just told me too. When did she tell you? When? Mm -hmm. Just then when I went in. Oh. But you're not you're not the target at all. What door? I always pull the wrong one. Did you end up putting your stuff in the dryer? Mix? I did, yes. I took yours out. It was finished. Oh, where is it? I put it on your bed. Oh, thanks, thanks. You're welcome. Sorry. I well, started chatting with her. Oh, of course. What the heck? I just got the nudes. Yeah, I'm on a block. Me and Rome. What? Okay, not know this. I kind of expected it. Fuck, I did not, I did not know that. Yeah. At least she gave me the heads up. Mm. Jesus Christ. You're taking it like a champ. Well, you're a pawn, clip. Pawn, 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 pawn. Am I really, though? Yes. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. 100%. Wouldn't you take the pawn to Wendy's? I think she wanted dirt. Yeah. Do you think she told her all? Uh, he knows he's going up. As of when? Huh? Since when? She pulled him at Wendy's. At Wendy's. Fuck. Oh my god. Girl. One, two, three. Who are, who are we missing? Those up there? It will still come down to whatever Ty and Jed and Brayden want. Do you know what Brayden. I mean? They want Rogan. They want Rogan. Yeah. Comp East. Puzzle. 
you know Jesus. Yeah. Hands You're down. Good. Hands down. Yeah. You are fine. You're good. You're good. It's just, I think when you feel too safe, that's when you're like, ooh. Yeah. At least you get to fight the veto. Against the guy who always wins veto. Hey. Here, I hate fucking walking into rooms. It was okay. I just told her that. I hate walking into rooms. I, didn't I requested uh, cinnamon spice and sticks. Oh. oh. Sticks? And sticks. I said, fuck me up. No, I was just. She telling. said, God, I didn't even realize. And, and she was like, the spice? I'm like, yeah, the spice. And I'm like, and the sticks. Oh, okay. yeah. shit. Sorry, go ahead. Oh, no, I was just Please telling. stop talking about production. Oh. That's not for you. That means we're not getting the sticks. <laughs> <laughs> Way to ruin it for everyone. <laughs> yeah, I was like, fuck, I'm going to be loved in here. No, no I just told her that. Beth just told me that she's put me up. Mm. I had no idea. Yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, I'm really sorry to be going up against the guy who uh, wins every veto. Can you wear my shirt when you get put up? <laughs> <gasps> don't worry, don't worry. But it's hey, I've been there, done that. Bring it in, bring it in. This is the first I'm hearing of this. Like I swear yeah. to God. I, I knew it was gonna happen. Yeah, she told me over Wednesday. So. Well, she told me I was going up. She didn't tell me who was going up next. Day, At least so. you got a burger. Huh? What'd you eat? Huh? I had You've big, gotten. I have not I gotten a, any treat food. I was a bacon eater combo. Mm-hmm. Oh God. You sure you want to hear this? I know, don't worry. Same here. I didn't even know they were doing that. I walked out to this. I'm like, you know. I want people to use those sweaters. I actually put, I should well, put one on I've, I've got one off this for you. Put it in or on me nerves. I do still have to wear one of these. Yes, I know, me yeah. too. I want yeah. that on me nerves on. I'm, I'm saying. Running out of clothes. As much, uh, Anytime, just as much First Nations the yeah, imagery on the nerves. that can be seen, I think the better. Yeah, 100%. Oh, oh my God. Ew. What the? F what was that? The, the bottom. bottom of this. Scrapes off the, bottom, the counter sometimes. Oh my god. If I never had to get that sound ever again, it would be too soon. <laughs> what if you just microwave that? Ew, really? Disgusting. Why? How would you eat it? How With a spoon. Would it be? Like soup? Sure. Try it. No thanks. In, like, I'll, I'll eat it. Do if, it. If you ever. No, Mike don't it. waste no, it. I like Microwave it. I'm that's, saving this for my right friends. Now. <laughs> no. It's Wait, so it annoying to make all this stuff. I think it'd be a cake. Those Motion crepes, inside. I don't mind them. Yeah, save them, you know? Hey, yeah. They're not that bad. <sighs> you know you make me wanna. So. Oh, yeah. Damn it. I hate myself. Oh. I keep singing. I wish we could just sing whatever we wanted. I wish I could create original music. You can, but they own it. Take it. What am I going to do with it? Could have been the next pop there. No. Zero percent chance. Zero. Thinking about shaving on Thursday, though. Have you shaved yet? Yeah. Like the whole thing? Oh, yeah, the whole thing. Ooh. Even the mustache? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Of course, yeah. the mustache. You, but you could rock just a stash if you wanted to. No, I look like, uh, what's, uh, wa Wario. I look like Wario. <laughs> <laughs> Wario, oh my god. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Oh, I walked god. in. To uh, an 80s party one time, of course I had the mullet, and I was like, I was growing my facial hair, so I just came in with just the stash. Yeah. And my sister's like, you look like Fat Mario. I'm like.
longer, but I prefer it like this one. I've always dreamed of getting middle hair. It's actually a good style, just in the middle. It's not even a style, it's just how it grows. And there's like a section on my chin. Like, one of my buddy's grows are really, really good. Middle part uh, snatch. It suits him too. Really? Yeah. His name is Chad. No, it's not. Yep. You would have friends with Chad, bro. Hey, Chad. <laughs> Hope all is well in Ottawa, Ontario. <laughs> Ottawa, Ontario. Hey there, buds. Went to a bar in uh, Ottawa one time. Oh, we're fucking set here, Blue Lime. Isn't that cumin? Or is that cinnamon? Cinnamon. Yeah, why you press more cinnamon? You got a whole bag there. Think money goes on trees? I didn't. I just said I didn't think that was there. No weed. This is also cinnamon. Paprika. Paprika. You want a glass of that, Joe? Yes. Sorry, queen. a mug of that, Joe? Yes, Queen. Who's in the studio? Toy and Bryden are yeah. playing chess. <clears throat> are we going to go chilling? OLG? Yep, that's where I'm headed to now. I'll get a cup of Joe. Cup of Joe? Got an OLG. Did you grab a cup for me, Ro? All right, in here. Feel I'll free to join us in the OLG. All right, I'm going to just probably check on my laundry. And then call it. I like the OLG, it's better in there. Yes. All right. Some laundry for some sunlight. Yeah, babe. You good? Yeah. I know you're upset. I just don't want to be next to you. Yeah. <sighs> There's a way out. We'll figure it out. I know. Hmm? Hmm? I'll come back. Thank you. Chance, just two and five. Mm -hmm. That's a good chance. Two and five is a good chance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How did she feel when you were with her? Like with Beth and the Wendy's? Um, really fine. We've had like maybe like one or two conversations on a game level. Mm -hmm. Like nothing crazy. And we did yeah. barely talk until like day 21, honestly. Mm -hmm. When Kyle and I were on the block. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was just like, look, like this is the move to make. Like, I have to put you on the block, and if I don't put you on the block, it's gonna look weird, and it's gonna put me in a rough position. So I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna come in here and like try, try to, not like, be on the it. block. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'd rather just be in it, and then I can play in the veto. <sighs> Otherwise, you know, I don't want you guys to be up, and then you know, first you're at risk of going home, and then I can be backdoored. So. This, honestly, just given the scenario, is probably the best case. Yeah, like, I'd rather have the chance to fight for it. Yeah. I just... Like, my worry is... Like, if you were clearly her target, mm -hmm. right? I don't really get why she would have brought you to Wendy's. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if she's kind of using me as a pawn. Mm -hmm. So, I feel like there are bigger moves, but maybe she thinks that I'm really gunning for her. And if you go mm -hmm. down, mm -hmm. she puts up Tina, mm -hmm. and then I'm going home. But then, like, if I come down, is she gonna put up somebody to ensure that you go home too? Mm -hmm. I 
Yeah. I just know for my game, mm -hmm. like without you, I'm kind of screwed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like if if you go this week, I'm going next week. If I don't win, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And kind of vice versa. They're just gonna keep saying our names. Yeah. Yeah. Same with you guys. Like okay. I mean, you guys here too. I just hate. Like I feel like we have no control. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you mean Tina won the veto? Like that'd be best case. Yeah, that would be good. <sighs> I just know that we should have kept Austin. I know, but... I didn't push it with Vic because I think she was the invisible agent. Yeah, that's right. I kind of feel like... I sort of know that she was. Yeah. Did she can, slip out? Well, can I tell you something? Did I already tell you this about... She got the slot pass yeah. before Noms went up. She's had it this entire time. And the only person she told was me, and I think it was a slip on her part. I think, because she, I, I was literally just sitting at the kitchen when she came out of the DR room. And she came out and she's like, oh my god. And I was very like, don't tell anyone. Don't tell anybody I got it. And if she wasn't, she have used it. Yeah. If she was, obviously, it doesn't make sense to use it. Yeah. That would look heat score. Yeah. I feel like she was. Definitely could have been. <sighs> but we have to keep that super low. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, there's just like like one thing with Ty where it was like we know Ty counted the rocks on the ground yeah and one thing they said to us was that the people who counted the rocks on the ground it wouldn't have changed the result of it right which means that Ty couldn't have won yeah that's the only thing if they, if they had say that I would have been like my only saving grace is that if you get in and yeah. come down yeah. she goes up but I think people are really scared to make that move I'm just worried if, like, I win and I take myself down, then they just are like, let's just get him out while we can yeah. and worry about her next week. You know what I mean? It's just a crappy situation. Just 
just big. We're talking because we're, we're bummed that we're going yeah. out, you know? Yeah. <sighs> I'm just frustrated because I don't know. I mean, you never know. Maybe they would take the shot at her. Beth wouldn't share anything with me. No. Not a lot with me either. Which I, I don't know. She, I think she didn't mean it. I just, I just know they lied to me. They lied to me this whole time. I think she just didn't mean Wendy's just like soft and blow, but whatever. At this point, I've been on the block. I want two vetoes. I'm gonna try it with my third. I think the best case scenario now for you and I to both stay in this game is if I come down off the block. Because if you come down, it's also good, obviously, for you for this week. But I know if anybody goes up next to me, then I'd probably go home. I know. So we'll try our best. And we'll have to see who's playing. You know, in an ideal world, it would be like it'd be like Tina, Brayden, and maybe even Kiefer, because I don't think Kiefer would try to win. Kiefer wouldn't try to win. I mean, just like there is a part of me that kind of I'm a little bummed. Yeah. That Kiefer and Tina aren't like really putting up a squam about me.
Brayden would use it on you. you do with my underwear row? <laughs> <laughs> my husband is going to be coming for you. <laughs> Ryan, just kidding. We have to figure out a way to get through this. We will, we will. And you can check my bag, I don't know. <laughs> if anybody has a thought, what's up? Okay. I'm not really, I just need a dart. We're getting open. We're gonna have to sit in this torture chamber. Is, uh, is the washing machine open? I have I have stuff in the dryer. Are you gonna steal more underwear for me if you or I have I stuff in the washer? You didn't even put it in. Check your drawers. Man, I like there. I folded I, three pairs of pants and a t-shirt. Well, I saw what you the folded, but it's in. they're not in here. I flipped it all inside out. Could have swore I had some of my favorite black seamless athletic thongs in there, and I can't find them. Check uh, Victoria's laundry. I'm going on the block and somebody stole my damn pen. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm. All right, all right. few things worse than being at the mercy of Jed and Beth. Fuck. Uh, 
Is it open? The washing? Um, I, I think that's Vic's stuff. I just turned it on because it still felt a little bit wet. Have you seen where she is? I'll ask her. I think I'll tell her that I her stuff. I heard her in HOH, I think. Oh, okay. Do you see what you were you when we're all saying oh you know we're just talking about how we're choked that we're going up together i don't know i feel like shit you're not going home you can't save me but you're not going home you can't save me though I'm you don't know that but you're not i'm telling you right now tina you don't know that and you cannot save me you and Kiefer cannot save me in this And if I win veto, I still don't think they're gonna put up Vic. They will get a row. Yeah, but and in that case, going is better than you going. And then we're just packing order. Legit, then we're just packing order. We already are packing order. They have the numbers now. Even if they change, even if it's me and Ro that stays up there, if they change their mind, Kiefer and you can't do anything about it. I honestly don't believe you're going home this week, though. Hmm? I honestly don't believe you are going home this week. I go with my gut on a lot of things. I still think they're telling the same things to Vic that they are saying to As in, you think they're telling Vic that you're going? Mm hmm. Or if Ro comes off, I'm going. She didn't put her on slop. She won't say her name. They told me they would put up Brayden and Ro, and they haven't. Why? How, on, how could I possibly believe? Just let it play out. You, would you be saying the same thing if your ass was on the block? No, I'd probably be fighting it a bit, yes yeah. or no. But maybe there's a bigger picture here. If she was putting you on the block, it would feel like a bigger picture. Because I already feel like they don't like me. That's not true. Come on. That's not true. You're full of it. <laughs> not, that's not true. Oh my God. That's not true, Tara. I honestly think... I'm just saying, don't be surprised if I come down and you go up. And if that happens, it happens. I don't think they're taking a shot at her. I think, once again, they're hoping that I will do it if I don't go. 
that's what they're setting up for. And they care so little about me that they also put me on slop, didn't take me to Wendy's. This is not true. It's not. You, it it you, may look like that, but it's not. Okay. It doesn't matter what you think. You and Keith can't save me in this. If they change their mind. If I get POV, I can. Oh, well, obviously, if I get house guest choice, I'm going to pick you. Mm -hmm. That's honestly best case scenario. Because then they can't fuck around and put you up. I honestly believe I will that. be picking you if I get house guest and choice. I will gun for it. Beth has already can't told make me. Any promises that I'll get it, but I will fucking gun for it. She's already told me that she would put pick Jedson if she gets house guest choice. And in that case, if he uses it again, he would probably take down Roe to try and cut a deal with Roe. So they do that plan. They will not save me. And like, if they're this not point, scared of her, but at this why point, are they acting like they're scared of her? They're if scared they're not, of her. They just don't want to deal with the repercussions of putting her up right off the hop. Who wants to deal with that all fucking week? Exactly. They think I'm weak. They no. think I'm expendable. No, they don't think that. <sighs> they don't think that. They just don't want to deal with the wrath. They're afraid of the wrath. And let them be afraid of the wrath. I think they have more fear as to what she could do in the event that next week is a double. They're yeah. really good with her. I mean, maybe. Maybe they're you've pulling been, the You've over. been saying that she's really good with the guys. She's good with the guys, but is she good with Beth? She was jumping up and down when Beth won. She was jumping up and down, but what happened when she left the room? I don't know. Exactly. I wasn't in the room. Neither was I, but who's to say that they didn't just all play along with it until she left the room? We don't know. Nothing is set in stone until the POV anyways. I know it sucks to be up on the block, but I literally trust Beth when Beth tells me that you're not going home. Did Beth say that to you? She said to me that she believes that you are not going home this week. So don't stress. But you cannot say that to anybody, okay? Mm -hmm. And I mean anybody. Don't even breathe a word of that. No, I'm to, not. To Vic. Of course not. Because in the event that one of you comes down and Bro doesn't go home, if she happens to be the person that they put up, she needs to be feel, felt safe. She's not going to feel safe. No, but... They're putting me in a jar so that I can't speak. You have to understand how frustrating that is. No, I can imagine. I don't think that you would be cool as a cucumber if it was you. Well, she can put me up. She's not putting you up first. doesn't matter. If she puts you up second, I'm going. I honestly don't think you're going. I really don't. And I don't know how to to convince you. Why would it make sense to get rid of you on this HOH when they have done nothing in the game up to this point and they have an opportunity to at least make a move that would give them something to talk about at the end of this game if they were to make it? If they think I'm coming for them. Don't let them think you're coming for them. If they think I'm coming for them, they already think it. Not necessarily. Not necessarily. Just don't let them think that, that's all.
I just know with how much shit they've talked about me, how much everybody's talked about me, I'm not a pawn. I'm not an easy pawn. And you have to recognize that. Yeah, Brayden wouldn't be an easy pawn. I get that. But Beth is trying to save face with Brayden right now so that Brayden is on her side. Exactly. She's not trying to save face with me in any facet. She put my ass on slot first. She did not take me to Wendy's. The only conversation we had, trust me, that's all she said to me. They won't even say her name to me. What makes me think that they would say it in front of everybody else? They won't even say her name to me. Because they're afraid to say her name to anybody. Well, maybe people need to be fucking afraid of me. But them being afraid of her... I just, that I makes just don't her think, a target. Yeah, I just don't think that they actually... I don't know. The guys seem like they're way cooler with her than they are with me. And the easiest way to break up our trio, which is numbers, is through me. They're not going to do it through Kiefer. People aren't even saying your name at all. Like, these are things that have to be considered. I don't want to be just blowing smoke up my ass telling me I'm safe when I'm, realistically, I am not. I know there's no guarantee of safety, but perhaps... You don't think that they see our three? No, I mean, they, they see Jed, Beth, and Ty as a three, and they see me, you, and Kiefer as a three. Mm -hmm. I get that. And you got Vic and Merle in the middle. Everything they do is calculated. Why wouldn't she take me to Wendy's? Why would she take Ro? And why, when I asked her, and when I asked Kiefer, and when I brought it up with Vic, they all had the exact same answer. Please do not be oblivious in this situation. What, what I answer? asked Beth, I asked Kiefer, I asked Vic. Why they thought Beth would take Ro and not me. And they all said they wanted to get dirt from Ro. Every single one of them told me the exact same answer. And then when I just talked to Ro, all he said was that she didn't say much. And all she said was that he was going up. So what dirt was she trying to get from Ro? Please stop telling me that I'm safe. I'm telling you right now, you do not know that. And she told me the same answer that Beth told me. The exact same answer. And Kiefer said the same one too. So what the fuck am I supposed to do with that? Well, I mean, if that's the case, then you're damned if you do, damned if you don't. If you blow up, that only gives them a reason. And you were there to hear the way Jed was talking to me. We didn't need your vote. We let you in on it. We didn't need it. Yeah, I mean, that was a little... Assholeish. I agree with that. Well, either Keefe in, in not, is not in as tight as he thinks he is. Why, why did Keefe have the exact same answer as Beth and Vic? For real. You don't think that's a little suspicious? No, it is suspicious, but it, Keefe knows it's not good for his game for you to leave.
they all have the same answer. That's all I'm saying. It's not as cut and dry as they are making it to appear. And I guarantee you, Tina, if I win that POV, they're putting you up, not her. Go for it. Because then they would have, like, two of their main targets and the possibility of one of them staying. I just can't see them doing it. There's a reason why they're not putting her up off the jump. And it's not because she's gonna cause a scene. No, you make some good points. I just don't get how you going would be a game move for best to use at the end should she get to a final two. How does that benefit her game? If she gets roll out this week, that's a benefit to her game. If she gets pick out, that's a benefit to her game. I don't get how either one of us would be a benefit to her game in the end. What would she say? Ooh, I got this one out. Does she think what we're going for her? She shouldn't. We haven't given her any reason to think that. I know other people might have suggested it. That's why we need to let her know that we're not going for her. I don't know, man. I just don't know why that Vic and Keith gave me the identical answer. What dirt? is Roe giving over Wendy's? What information do you need if he's going up regardless? <sighs> do you know what I mean? What did Rose say in the bathroom? Just that. That was. What, in the bathroom? Yeah. Oh, in both. Just that he's going up. She told him that he was going up. I don't know what dirt he would have for her. No, he wouldn't. That's the thing. He doesn't. So why did they all tell me that that's why she would give him wings? Like, doesn't that alone look sketchy? If I'm just your pawn, you're trying to build trust. You're telling me to trust you. You put me on slot. You do not take me to Wendy's. And now three people who are all in on this plan, except for her, have given me the same answer as to why you didn't take me to Wendy's. How does everybody know your exact reason? And the word, they all use the word dirt. They all use the word dirt, every single one of them. What dirt does Rohan have to give them? What up? What up, dog? I'm just chilling. What are you doing? Oh, same. 
Bored? Yeah, bored. <sighs> oh, it feels good to lay down. Yeah. Oh my god, if it's just noms tomorrow, no POV. Kill me. No backyard. Just light up. Wait, what are they going to do? They're already on swap. Hmm? They're already on swap. What would they do? I don't know if that would be like an offense to get kicked off the show. Oh. That's a yikes. Yeah. Excuse me. We need you to cheer up. Yeah, until the yard opens up, it's probably not going to happen. <laughs> Tell some jokes. Tell some jokes. I pray there's no such things as guardian angels watching over me. Because I masturbate a lot. Jesus and that would, Christ, Keith. <laughs> that would be weird. What makes you think they'd want to see that? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, They're maybe they always turn, watching. Maybe they turn They're back on. They're watching for like, protection. They can tell if you're in a pickle. As part of a, not if you're playing. It was one of pickle. my early stand-up <laughs> jokes I wrote. Like I'm done being protected. I'm out here on my own. <laughs> I do too much weird shit alone. What's the weirdest thing you do alone? I don't want to say. Uh, I don't television. even know if I want to fucking know, Keith. <laughs> I really don't at this point. <laughs> I would like to know. No. It's not that weird. It's normal guy things, I think. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? Don't what else? Know. I have it all written down on my phone. Don't want to know. Please and thank jokes. you. I can't think of any. Oh, boy. Who's all floating around? Or are they all in the HOH? Uh, Ty Braden and Ro were downstairs, and then Vic Jet and Beth were in HOH. Then us three. Big Jed and Beth, eh? Here. Who's with Jed and Beth? Vic. How do you feel about that? I feel okay. Who do you think she's really going to put up if I would take myself off? If you took yourself off? I think yeah. she'd put Brayden up as a pawn. Yeah. So why do you think she took Ro to Wendy's? Just to get information. She well, took... But what info could Ro even give her? 
I have no idea. The move perplexed me as well. I don't get it. Best case scenario, Rose is on the block. That's the point we're at in this game. Second best case scenario. No, for best case scenario, you pull yourself down. Hmm. Second best case scenario, Rose stays on the block. Third best case scenario, Rowe pulls himself down. Fourth best case scenario, I have a secret power <laughs> by the end of this week. Add another target. We take them. Yeah, that'd be good. But I don't have a secret power yet. Has anybody been in the ball pit lately? Because that's where the, that's where it's going. I so. have not, no. But I will. After a good night's sleep. Morning swim. I just don't see a scenario where you go home. Wait till you watch back. You're going to be like, damn it, Tara. I should have been. Damn it. That's what you're going to say. I just don't think that they would actually put up Vic. You're crazy to think that. We have to make them think that they'll put up Tina. Hmm? We have to make Vic think that they'll probably put up Tina next to you if Ro comes down. Mm -hmm. Because if any word gets out about anything, shit's going to be crazy. And there's no need if the noms stay the same or you pull yourself down. Yeah, I agree. This place sucks. <laughs> Especially when you don't have the backyard. Huh? Especially when you don't have the backyard. Yeah, true. Tomorrow night we'll have it, maybe, hopefully. Well, you think they're gonna do knobs and the ceremony all same, like everything all the same day? Yeah, I think so. Do it like they did last week. Yeah, do you think so? I think yeah. so. To mess up our days. Which I really need to get under control in my head. Yeah. Don't worry about that right now. Okay. True. I absolutely true. True, 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 true. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, hopefully the veto is something I can do. Listen, when you're talking to Vic over the next few days, just. Wait. She won't talk to me. She's like, I walk in the room, she walks out. That's good. It's fine. Because I think the only, like if you get pulled down, Vic's not gonna go up because they would rather have Rohan go home. That's the feeling that I get. But if Rohan comes down and there's no chance Vic uses the veto, zero. She would never. You don't think so? She would never. Do you think they're banking on the fact that Ro's going to get the POV? Hmm? Do you think they're banking on the fact that Ro's going to get the POV and Hom sent down? Like, is there a possibility that both of us are up? No. I don't think so. Not from the conversations I had. Are they worried about hour three? No. No, they're worried about Ro and Vic. <laughs> Again, we gotta be very careful about even talking about that. No, I know. Yeah. Because if it don't happen, then it never happened. But when it does happen, get ready.
fourth best case scenario I thought of it. Instant eviction. When? This one. How do those work? No POV. Rose gone. You're off the block. Playing in the next HOH before you know it. Why would the backyard be closed if that was the case? Yeah. For the next HOH. Jesus, they can't keep closed for a week. I'm losing my mind. Who knows? That's one scenario. That's fourth best scenario. Aren't instant evictions usually like kind of on the spot? I have no idea. I've never even seen one. Just heard people talking about I feel about like them. they're like right after that HOH. <laughs> like we're about to have an instant eviction. I don't think they make you like sit all week. <laughs> I can't remember actually. No, because an instant eviction would technically be a double eviction, but they're different. I think they still give people who are on the block a chance to make their pitch. You know what I mean? Oh, my back. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Hmm. Well, shit. We've been big brothered. Let's go pee. We're back and bath. I really don't think you need, need to worry. I know you can't be comfortable, comfortable, but. The gist I got from Beth is she's ready to make big moves. If she thinks I'm coming for her though, that would be a big move for her. She doesn't think you're coming for her. No? No, she really doesn't. I just don't get the Wendy thing. I didn't either. And I haven't talked to her since that. I didn't mm. know. I thought she was taking Jed. Yeah, me too. I don't know. I hope this veto is something I can do. But I feel like if I win it, they're going to I think it was uh, just like to make good with Roe in case he did win the POV. Yeah. So Ro wouldn't come after her if he were to win. Yeah. You know what I mean? I know. So nobody wants to make good with me is what is weird. I feel like if I take myself down, she's going to put up Tina instead. I don't think she's going to put up Brayden. She could put up me. I don't think she would do that. I just don't know. I don't see any scenario where Braden goes up. The scenario would be you pulling yourself down. He would go up. I think she would put up Tina, not Braden. I don't think so. Well, she might, but then Tina stays. Yeah. So I don't. But this is what I mean, like it shows like where we are in their order. Oh, I know. You know. But what can we do? Yeah. We have no power. It is unfortunate though. Best case scenario is if she wins veto and uses it on me. That is best case scenario. That's actually the best case scenario. It is. So 
freaking win it. Honestly, I think this is going to sound crazy, but I think if you got House Guest Choice, you should pick Jed. I was told to gun for Why would I be told to gun for So Rohan doesn't win. No, I'm gonna gun for it anyways. Yeah, of I'm course. Gonna for Same it because here. I'm gonna take her down. Yeah. Yeah, but Jed wouldn't use the veto on me. No, he, he wouldn't use it. On use Ro. it. He would not use it on Ro. Then he would keep it the same. Yes, he would keep it the same. So I can't pick him. Why not? If he's not going to use me, and he's going to keep it the same. I can't pick him. Yeah, I know. It's just our best chance of Ro not winning it. Yeah, but it's somebody who would not. Like you can't pick somebody that you know will not use it. I would pick Tina. That's the only person I know that would maybe use it. Yeah. I don't think you're in a position where you could use it. They would be pissed. They'd probably put up Tina. Hmm? They'd probably put up Tina if I were to use it. That's what I mean. Yeah. I mean, it, the noms stay the same, though. Like, you're safe. Yeah. Or would they want to split up our three because Rose by himself? No, they don't even think we're a three. They think Ty I... does. Does he? Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. Ty said to me today, hmm. he said, the Vic and Rose are in the middle. And he said, if you potentially look at Beth, Jed, and Ty, and he said, Tara, Tina, and Kiefer, he split us. Hmm. Well, yeah, then shit. I don't know what to do. Hope for the best. Where did he put, where did he put Braden with them? He did put Braden with them. Yeah. Well, he said three and three. He said with Vic and Ro. Straight up. Whatever they want to happen this week will happen. We have no choice. That's what I'm saying. And it's not going to be you going home. They have nothing on their resume. They literally have nothing. And if this is Beth's last age of age, she's not going to win the game if the only person she got out is you. Yeah. Is I your... honestly believe that, though. I really do. She's looking to make a move that will potentially give her something to say in the end if she gets to the end. Because there's a good chance she could get to the end. But she can't win in the end if she hasn't done nothing. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Oh, I hope the beta is tomorrow. I want to dart. That's all I want to do. Dart it up. Ball's eye. Yeah. I don't know. Worrying right now isn't good enough. We just need to get that POV. Just win it. Take yourself off the block. Mm -hmm. Be a young Kiefer Carlson out there. First time on the block. Big V to win. I know, it just sucks because I do think if I win it, they're going to put her up. They won't put up Braid. And then again, we're in a situation where I don't think that they would take her out. But if they wanted to change their mind, they could. I don't think that they would, but it's still like we have no control. That's what happens when you don't win. You winning is best case scenario and taking me off. Mm -hmm. That would be a dope POV ceremony. I wouldn't even stress if I went, if I went on the block, I wouldn't stress if I was sitting next to row. Yeah. So you shouldn't. You would be in a better position to not stress. Because I'm a comp beast. Yeah. No, you would just be in a better position because I think they do trust you. I don't think that they trust me. I really don't. Yeah, I don't know if they trust me. Really? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if anybody trusts me. I know you guys do. I have been having some good chats with Ty, but that's all it is, is chance. Yeah. Because that's like my way to Beth's ear is through Ty. Oh, like everything you say to him goes to her? 
Yes, I think so. Information that I would want to get to her, or I would want them to think alike. I'm very persuasive. It's a veto I can do. I think it's gonna be the word one that he said. You're like crawling through things, trying to find things, and there's like potential prizes in there. Yeah. That's what I think. That one might not be too shabby. I think I would be alright with that. Hell, yes. Beth did tell me if she got house guest choice that she would pick Jed. I'm telling you, that's not the worst news. <gasps> oh, I'm tired. I want to take a nap. Go to the ball pit. Find a secret power. I wish. I want one really bad. I want to be that guy. Where should we go melon now? Here? There? Anywhere? Top of the stairs? There's... I just am so bored. So bored. Mm-hmm. And my eyes are burning. I'm so tired. Why did you stay up? What was the know. point was of that? Laughing around. Well, now you're tired now. I know. I don't know why you guys do that to yourselves. It's fun, joking around. I forget what we even were talking about, to be honest. You were actually messing with my sleep. You could hear us? No, I just kept hearing, Tashawn, put on your microphone. Yeah. Just like, yeah. I just kept hearing them over the loudspeaker where it's like, great. It's like, Shut so up. they're having big, Dude. super serious game talks in the middle of the night? No, we weren't. That's why I was getting mad. I started banging on the windows, telling them to turn the light off. Yeah. And they were like, they gave me a kefir, stop that. And I was like, why are the lights on? Freaking out. And then we were wondering why Tishan even had to put his microphone on. Because they told us to go to bed. Yeah. Nothing was making sense. And the fourth battery change. Hey, girl. Everything was not making sense. How's it going? Sense. Pretty good, just, you know, doing my rounds. Around the house, and then to every room at least once. Yeah. Turned on my laundry to dry three times. Is it still not dry? No, one more. No, you're gonna. Let me know when yours is done because I have stuff in the wash. I'll swap it out. <laughs> hey, babe. Yeah. I've not seen you, been able to talk to you since, but it's you're okay. good. I know. It's just a bummer, right? You don't want to be sitting on the block. Yeah. That's just the, and you never know, like, if you're the target or if you're not, that's all. You're not. Yeah. All I can do is trust and maybe. How could you possibly think you're a target sitting beside Rowan? Yeah. And I love Rowan as a savage. Like, obviously, it yeah. sucks, but it, it is an individual day, game yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah. Have you won two vetoes? Like, are you, have you thrown everyone under the bus when you've been in Pat, like, late? Yeah, yeah, like, do you yeah. know what I mean? Like, there's so, and ha he's verbally said he would be going after them. Yeah, yeah, have yeah. Have you done any of those things? No. That would be fucking insane. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, you know, like, yeah. just that would be freaking insane. Yeah. It just sucks because, like, we no longer, like, have numbers, right? Like, even if I have your three, if that's what they wanted, I'm not saying that is. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. just don't have numbers it, anymore. You lose that, like. We don't have numbers. <sighs> we lost them. Fuck, when did this happen? When we sent Austin home. Because I think Brayden is a number for them. Think he's well, talking with Rowan right now. 
Well, I only think because it's with Beth, not the boys. Yeah, maybe not. You know. You had any conversations with yeah. any of them today? Yeah, like very briefly, I went in there, but they were all in there, so it didn't really go far. I just kind of said thank you for not putting me up. Yeah. Yeah. It was when it, like when we voted out Austin, everybody said that it would be Brayden and Roe. So obviously now I'm a little taken aback that it's me and Roe. That's why I feel uneasy, because that was supposed to be like the next move. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. So that's the only reason why I'm like a little. Did you say that? Yeah, and Beth just said that she never said Brayden. Okay. I just would not be worried at all. Like, from what I just got in there, yeah. you're definitely not the target. With it, where? Like, I was just came from the HOH room. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, and I was just, the three of them are in there, and I just, you know, things are going up. I heard, like, what the plan is, like, like who's going up, like, I, like, do you mind sharing with me, like, what the plan is, whatever. And they just said, she just said, like, she said, like, yeah, like, Rose my target. Like, he's very powerful in this game, and I just don't believe that he's not coming after us. I got to protect me and my people. Mm -hmm. I said, cool. I said, well, sounds good. That's good that they said that to you, because yes. that's what they said to me. Yep, yeah. that's exactly what she just said, and I said, sounds good. So I, I do have to, like, just good. trust that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And I do, I do believe that that's who yeah. their target is. Yeah, really yeah, me too. Like, yeah. and if you think about it like this, that's the boys' target. It's, it's going to be her target as well. Like, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, flexible. <laughs> <laughs> <Fix it>. <laughs> <laughs> Look, okay, that's a new angle. You're getting like more. Oh Jesus. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> My legs are sore. Why? Then at least I can Probably play from in a doing nothing. Yes. Exactly. Please. Have you had one since the apple cart? Mm. No, I've only had these stupid apple cart where I can do nothing with a wheelbarrow. Let's go, girl. You go. <laughs> exactly. Hopefully I get a cute outfit because your guys' outfits were super cute last time. They were pretty cute, weren't they? Mm -hmm. So Ooh, cute. I think if either of you don't play, you're going to be the host. What are you <laughs> oh yeah, neither one of you have hosted yet, right? No. Did Brayden host yet? No. No. Oh, it could be any of us. Okay. So between uh, you two and Brayden, then for sure. Yeah. Let's see who gets picked after we get picked. Or we'll maybe she'll pick Jed. Be like, Jed, you want to host? Oh. oh yeah, you got to see who's actually playing it. Yeah. yeah it's, I don't know. Playing. I never have any power, so I don't know the the, the way that things work. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? I like know. I don't know the. That's okay. I just I just don't want you to worry, and I just don't want. No, you to... it's just a bummer. Just... It is. It is. Yeah. You get another six hours to be bummed out. And if you're still bummed out after that, I'm going to be fucking pissed. Six hours? Yeah, I'm going to go make myself a huge target and start a fight with someone. Who's going to fight? Probably Brayden. <laughs> Good choice. Yeah. Listen, Brayden, let's talk about it. Whoops, period. <laughs> no. How long have you been talking to these two? How long have I been talking yeah, to these two? Because they both have something in their teeth, and I'm wondering when you were no. going to tell them. Do they really have something in their teeth? Shit too. I swear I did not. How did you, where did you have it? In, where I was like, I right can't do this. Like right in the front. Like right in the front. Where did you see anything? Yeah. No, I, I didn't see Carrie. Ro's getting shit too. That was too funny. I swear. Hey, Ro. Is this lint from my Wait, socks? Wait, oh, I don't care. I'm putting a cover on it anyway. I, I know, but I just I did not I feel see bad. anything in your fucking teeth. Uh, where was yours? You're a real in one. In the front, no. In the front? We're not talking about it. <laughs> It's gone now. Wow. Oh, that's good stuff. That's crazy. <laughs> crazy. Yeah, oh. Terry needs to not stress. I know, stress. she's good. She she's just, good. like I said, six more hours. Mm -hmm. She better have the sealies tonight mm -hmm. or I'm going to be fucking cheesed. Mm -hmm. I swear, I did, she's out there fucking rhyming. Off, huh? <laughs> Riding. <laughs> Here? Sorry, blue line. <laughs> Thanks. Like thick. Oh, I didn't swear I didn't see anything in her fucking mouth. If I did, I would have fucking told her. Bye. Oh, that's funny. you're like, how long have you been talking? I was like, well, I started talking to Tina on day Bro. one. Tara was more like day three. Where day was four. it? Seriously, was it in the in front? In the very front, too. Okay, I did not see it in the front, too. I didn't notice either. See? I just always get lost in her eyes. Oh. What? Well, Canada, just... now we know who your real friends are. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Got you guys. Holy crikey. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow, Tina. Oh my God. You know, it you think you know someone. You come into a house And I had that slot pancake. <laughs> I was, oh, oh for fuck's sake, win. whatever. Oh shit. I had that slot pancake a long time ago. 
Yeah, there was something in my teeth, I guess, in my photo shoot. <laughs> was there really? Yeah, in the picture, there was something in my teeth. I, see, I didn't hard. see I anything in the picture either. I could not see it. I guess you know your teeth. Mm -hmm. I was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> well, kind of went down a little. You're all good. It was like big black, too. I don't know how you guys didn't see it. Well, if it was on notice. the side, I wouldn't have seen it. No, it's like right here. Yeah, I wouldn't have seen it. I'm looking at the other like side. Like I of your said, team. I just get lost in your eyes. That's what Ro just said. Did he? Oh. He's like, I was too busy looking in your eyes. I'm like, I'm so mad I could take off this flannel, but I won't because it's comfortable and you're not getting it back. <laughs> that block shit, that's for Ro's show. Send him home, that's a faux show. Oh. Okay. As long as he doesn't win that beat toe. Oh! Oh my god, if he does. He ain't. He ain't. Oh, if he does, me or Brayden are does. going up. No, if he does, I'd say I'm going up against her. Guaranteed. Yeah. I don't think it's guaranteed. They're going to probably talk about it, but they're not going to waste this HOH. It's going to be a big move. I don't think that's you guys. Right. He's not winning. Let's not even think about it. It's not yeah, happening. He's not winning. Well, and that's like another level of stress, right? Like he's just won two back to back, like and crush yeah. them. Well, what is the chances he can do another? Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. If Jed's in the veto, that's a great thing for if us. If you get players pick, you need to pick Jed. Honestly, that's the best case for your game. I know that's not our blue line. Yeah, I don't think Jed would use it. I think, yeah, I know. Oh, I guess, you know but that's I mean? not what you want. I just meant to keep Ro up there because he's yeah, the target. Would, but that I'm makes sure sense. Yeah, sorry. Her. I wasn't thinking. Because I feel like you have to pick somebody that you think would potentially Yeah, use I wasn't it. thinking. That obviously is the right move. Sorry. But I still think Jed would be a good trick to beat Ro and keep him up. Yeah, because the worst thing would be that, Jed, that um, Ro wins it, right? Yeah. No offense to us, but if it's us and Ro playing in the veto, he's got a better chance of beating us. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. this could be the five. That could be the five playing in the veto. And if you get a house guest choice, and Jed's not up there, he's mm. our best shot. Well, Ro beat Jed before. I know. There were rumors that he did. He wasn't even trying, but I don't believe that. I don't believe it either. He dropped four balls. I know his yeah. knees. Like, who would yeah. throw a comp and have knees like that after? Yeah, yeah, that's a... Mm -hmm. Ro just finessed those balls in there. If Jed didn't drop, he would have won. So would have Beth, actually. I'm just glad it wasn't in that comp. Oh, my God. It's all right. We're making it through this week, guys. We're going to finagle our, our way finagles. <laughs> yeah, we're from the finaglers. <laughs> We're the fun time finaglers. Mm -hmm. Then Lena. Then Lena. Holy shit, I gotta piss out of my ass right now. That's great, thanks. Like Girl. you have to take a poop? That is fucking weird. <laughs> God. Okay, go do it. Don't shit yourself there, please. Poor V's bed will be ruined. V's like, hell, get the hell out of my bed now. <laughs> And I gotta make it sand. Gonna... Hey, you gotta let me know in the dryer when you pull your crap out if you find any random small black thongs. I will let you know. Are you taking Are you your stuff out right now? Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm just gonna get my stuff. Oh. See if it's dry. It's been taken. Are you gonna bring it right in? I don't actually have to piss probably, out of my yeah. ass. I just have to pee. Get some sour keys, maybe. Possibly. Well, I'm gonna. I'll. When you take your, I've got stuff that's gotta go in the dryer. I'll follow you. Come. You keep me posted if you find any little teeny black thongs. They're my favorite. I hate when people find my underwear. So don't worry. I They're you. gone. They're my favorite. Teeny tiny. We're going to be all right. So are they telling you to tell Tara to pick Jed? No, I honestly think that she should. Why would she say it to? I have no idea. She should pick Jed. It's her best chance to beat Ro. I don't. She just doesn't want to stay up on the block. I know she doesn't want to stay up on the block. But, I mean, yeah. I just think Jed's their best shot at beating Rome in a POV. To me, it's worst case scenario, Rome coming down. That's what I think. 
He's too good. And Vic will take the shot just like Rome will take the shot. You say that, I don't believe that. I know. I'm sorry, but I don't. I know. I think there's even something you don't know about. I don't think so. But yeah, I get yeah, it. Yeah, I hope I'm wrong. But I don't know. Let's have to see how, how it all plays out. I'm going to give you a big old I told you so. Oh, I, and I hope you do tell me I told you so. It's coming. Is it? Oh, it is. I rue of the day. <gasps> I can't wait. I think it'll probably be on... Oh, I mean, day 42, maybe, when I'm HOH. Like I could told you so. Yeah, you might. Or, Listen. no, 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 42, Vic's HOH. Okay. You and can, where else? If, if Vic gets HOH and she takes a shot, you can rub it in my face and say I told it you so. It would be Brayden and Beth on the block. Her target would be Beth. It would guarantee that if Jed or Ty won the POV, they can't pull Beth down. Because the other one would go up and the other one would go home. Yeah, and I believe that. That's not, that's not a shot, in my opinion. I think she has something with the guys. Yeah, for sure. That you that you don't know about. Oh, for sure. Mm. I'm not denying that. Yeah, well, that's that's the point I'm trying to make. Oh. She won't take that shot. I can tell you that right now. I, think, well, I mean, yeah. She will not take that shot. Ever. It's not going to happen. Mm. Ro will. Think about that. You won't take the shot. I won't. I can't. Exactly. It would sour my jury. That's right. <laughs> but Ro will take the shot. Well, maybe he wins that POV. Get out a giant target, and we have the same numbers we would no matter the scenario of whatever happens this week. It's not worst case scenario if he wins. It's just the road less bumpy. This game sucks. <laughs> I don't know if I'd come back and do it again. Although I would have the experience of doing it already. You know what I mean? So I wouldn't make the mistakes that I made the first time. So maybe I would come back. <laughs> but then it's a whole set of new circumstances. Exactly. And people would be like, oh, you were from last season. You did all this, blah, blah, blah. Where are you going? To the bathroom. I actually do have to use <laughs> That's great. That's great. Thanks for that. I don't got to piss out of my butt, though. Yeah, okay. Thanks for that. Not us playing mind games with them. Sorry? Not us playing mind games with them. Yeah. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, Tina and Tara are like, are you sure Brayden's with us? I think he's with them. I was like, yeah, oh, I crazy. I need to talk to them. Huh? I need to talk to them. That was like one thing Austin told me when we were sitting here mm -hmm. right before. Mm -hmm. She was like, you need to make sure that you keep checking with Tina and Tara. Mm -hmm. Like, you need to make sure. Mm -hmm. She was like, sit them down. Once a day, if you need. Once yeah. every few days. Yeah. And she's like, and just literally like reiterate to them that like, yeah, like, you're here for them. Mm -hmm. And she's like, tell them that they take any like paranoia they have, any whatever, because. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was just like, no, he is like he's for sure. Also, I, 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 I like. 100% sure now that it was Vic. Yep, I'm pretty sure. Like, I'm 100% sure. Like, 100. Yeah. You know? Yeah, because she, she never liked you and Austin together. Mm -hmm. She kept Why? asking me, how do you feel about Brayden and Austin? I don't really trust them. They never leave each other alone. No, it all makes sense. Mm-hmm. And Austin said that she kept saying, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Yeah. Why would you be sorry? Yeah, it's just so fucking frustrating. I wish she would have taken a shot. Yeah, exactly. That's why I told her in the ball pit. I was like, don't fall for the guys. That's exactly what she's doing. 
a nightmare. Yeah, it's just like annoying. And she, even, she told me again this morning. She's like, we weren't even talking about it. About what? Hey, the Invisible Age Witch. We weren't even talking about it this morning. She's like, it was time. I was like, I was like crazy. Why are we still talking about it? Literally. And Jen even said to me in that room last night, mm -hmm. he's like, there's no way. There's no way. He's like, that me and Jen would not go up if it was not Nick. You think that's the only way mm -hmm. that we would not go up? Mm -hmm. And you know, you. Nick kept playing the whole time um, that, what's it called? He's like, they would never, ever put each other on slot. So you know, they keep saying they would, and that's what they do. They would never, ever do that. Mm-hmm. But then, so you know how Vic told you the thing that Beth's did? That she slept? Beth said that Vic did that. That's what I thought. Remember when we were at the table and I was like, well, Vic told... Or when we were in the hot tub yeah, and I was like, well, it was Vic. Vic that told me that. Yeah, Beth was like... Vic Jeb was like, yeah, what's it called? Like, Beth was in the room with Vic and she was like... Oh, you know, Jed has a vote, Ty has a vote, Beth has a vote, Ah, um, Ro has a vote. And then I was like, hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's her. It's just annoying. Yeah. You know? Why is this so fucking frustrating? Yeah, because why? I, mean, I don't know why she would tell Austin. Oh, like, I don't think Tina and Tara will need to take a shot and then tell me, oh, I know they would for sure. Mm-hmm. So which one is that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't, uh... I don't, uh, trust her. Same. Because there's been a couple of things over the last week Keeps, she keeps saying things to make it sound like she's not, mm -hmm. but it's just like, she keeps telling me, oh, I would never do anything to disrupt you and I, like we're in the Burlington Hamilton Alliance, like, I would never do that to my hometown, to my mm -hmm. city. I was like, that's such a bullshit thing to say. Like, well, why would you, like, who cares where we live? Yeah. It doesn't matter. And she keeps saying that. And she's okay too. She's like, I got you, Bray, like, yeah. I got you, don't you yeah. worry. Yeah. Of course, she's going to come to say that to you because the vote was unanimous. Mm -hmm. no, the vote was going to be unanimous. Today, yeah. I was in the room and she's like, I got you, like, but next week, like, we're good. Like, we're good. That's why she started. That's why she tried to start all this stuff around a flip because she wanted to make it seem that she was saving yeah, you. Yeah, like, exactly. Exactly. I already know that's why she tried to put space between us by saying, yeah. Rose campaigning, just so you know. Just yeah. so you know. Yeah. And then even, uh, what's it called? Like, right after? Uh, Beth won. She like comes up to me and she's like, like me and you're good this week. She's like, you know, the others like Rose probably not gonna be good this week, so like we're good. Vic said that. Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, oh, okay. Because I'm like, are you not like in my back of my mind? I'm like, are you not working with him? Yeah. Because yeah. obviously, like if it was me and Austin, they would be like, yeah, like we gotta find a way to like make sure Austin can stay. Yeah. Yeah, she's uh, she's not trustworthy. Oh no. I, I never fully trust her after, uh, And neither did I. Yeah. That's what they said. They're like, she yeah. flies both sides of the house. She's a great liar. She's a great leader. player. She's a great yeah. cop beast. Like, they're like, well, the way that she is acting, like, uh, like in this room. They're like, well, when we had to walk around. Yeah. And then they're like, the way that she was acting. Yeah. They're like, come on. Because yeah. she's like, Beth was like, she turns to me and she's like, Beth, I fucking know it's you. Like, how could you fucking put me on slot? And then Beth was like, what? Like, it's not me. And then she's like, and then she just let it go. And she's like, oh, okay, I trust you then. Yeah. And she's like, anyone who, like, genuinely thinks it's you, then I was going to tell you once and then get over it. Yeah. And they're like, oh, yeah, like, at the dinner that night, they're like, that was her acting. Like, she's purposely saying things. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, it's, it, yeah, it's, at, at first, my top three were Beth, Deshaun, and Vic. Those were my top three. And then I eliminated Vic. And I eliminated Beth, and then I was like, it's definitely Ty. I was so sure it was Ty. 
the only thing that was like I was kind of wavering on is the fact that those eight rocks that fell, he counted them. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and they said that wouldn't have changed the outcome of the competition, mm -hmm. which tells me it couldn't have been Ty. Mm -hmm. That's think. the only thing. Same. And then all these things that have happened over the last four days makes me think it's her. Yeah, like why is she crying to Austin? Yeah. That was crazy. I like, what is going on? And she told me she left uh, a couple of Austin's, like, a couple of hair clips that Austin likes in her bag mm -hmm. to take with her. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's weird. Hey, guys. Don't get too excited. You got the slap out of your teeth? I got the slap out of my teeth, and I'm going to make some more muffins. Yeah! Let's go. <laughs> I only like slop when you're on it with me. It's yeah. just, it re really is top tier muffins. They are they top are tier. They are top tier muffins. Ooh. I wish I just had more pans so I could make like 3,000 at a time. <laughs> um, should we start pushing to come in Tara and then it was back? Actually, Tara, when I went to consult Tara after she found out she's getting nominated, she told me she knows for a fact it's Vic. Yeah. Austin told me. She's yeah. like, I left the seat. Yeah. She's like, go to them and tell them that it's like. Yeah. Yeah. And I was I, gonna. Just. I was gonna. I, I told them I have to. I was like, I need to talk to you guys where they have yet to be alone. Yeah. And just like, even when she was in the ball pit, she's like, if it were, if I were in this ball, she's like, I would make a big move. Like, I'm putting the boys up on the block. Yeah, she'd been saying. That was like crazy. She really did me so dirty. Crazy, she did you so dirty. I can't believe we just got absolutely fucked by Kiefer's HOH and by fucking Vic's Invisible. Like two people that we thought could have won. Yeah. Won and we're getting just absolutely fucked. And like, so like I know the thing that really screwed me in Austin is that you're right, she was really jealous and like at the beginning, um, like when Vic was away, she like came to me and Austin and was like, yeah, like let's make like a trio on the lines, like I think I'd be like a blah, 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 blah. Yeah. And then like she even said, she's like, I don't know what happened, but like after like that week, I was like, wait, you guys just kind of like left me in the dust. Yeah. And I knew it was, and when she said that to me, I knew it was exactly that it was her. Yeah. yeah. She's like, yeah, like I know, like I thought we had something, but like you guys just kind of like left me out of rot and like, there's no follow-up, there's no communication, and, like, I wanted to work with you guys. And, you know, things just didn't work out that way, I guess. And then, like, so, instead of having a conversation with me... Yeah. You put me up. Yeah. Someone who literally even was not even going to go after you for a while. Yeah. As soon as Austin talked to Vic, I talked to Austin. And she said there were a number of things that she said in the conversation that made her think it was her. Yeah, it was Austin that came to Austin was like, not us talking about our, our campaign conversations. I was like, anyways. It's fucking crazy. So, plan moving forward. You're going to talk to Beth. Mm -hmm. I would leave the invisible HOH stuff out of it. Oh, yeah. Even though I'm pretty sure Beth knows it's fact. I've already anyway. talked about Beth with her yeah. and she's like, I know it's fact. Okay. I know for a fact. And I was okay. like, but we can be clear about I don't know what Beth wants to do this week, but you can be clear about the fact that she's going to put her up if you want, whatever you think is best. I think I will. I just don't even care if it's getting after me. What the fuck ever. I don't even yeah. care anymore. It's just like, what do we have to lose? Because I already know. How? If it wins next week, I'm probably going up anyways. Yeah. But she vocalized to you, to me, and to Tina and Tara and Austin. Actually, you weren't in the room. No, I wasn't. Oh, you weren't in the room. I forgot about this. Yeah. It was me, Tina, Tara, Austin. And uh, Vic was like frustrated about the bag in the room and like how Beth like, you know how Beth like kind of comes in a room to yeah. listen what's going on. So like, mm -hmm. Beth was like rummaging through like, she was like rummaging through her bag basically. Yeah. And didn't like, she didn't take anything from the bag. Mm -hmm. And she just left the room. And then Vic's like, I fucking hate it when people do that. Mm -hmm. And she's like, guys, like if I win HOH next week, I'm putting up Beth and Jet. No, that's really, when we were having our one-on-one -on -one yeah. in Team Defender, yeah. I was like, yeah, like, pick up here and make a big move. Like, yeah. I was like, we've been talking, like, I'll put up the boys next week. Yeah. And she's like, good. And she's like, oh, I was like, Vic, like, we have to make big moves. I was like, yeah. like, Vic, you already made a big move for Tony. Like, it's my turn. Yeah. And then I was like, well, what are you thinking? Yeah. And she's like, honestly, she's like, she's like, oh, if I put I'm putting up Jed and Beth. 
Yeah. So, wait, no, I shouldn't say that, but like, yeah. so what I was thinking is, I'll be like, bro, and I talk to bro, and like, he always doesn't know if he's going, and I was very vague. Yeah. Um, he, I was just like wondering, like, he's just asking me, like, if like I were to play in the beetle, like, what I really do. Yeah. Can I say that? Yeah. And then I was like, I don't know. And I was like, I was like, I need to talk to you, obviously, because it's your HOH. Yeah. I was, I was like, I don't have anyone in this game, I told them. Yeah. And I was like, I just kind of have you back, so. Yeah. Um, like, what do you think I should do? Like, should I tell him that if he pick, like, if he gets asked, he has to pick me? And like, do you want me to gun for it? Like, what? And then I'll be like, he also, like, brought up the fact that, like, should I bring up the Vic thing? Should I be like, he brought up the fact that, like, apparently Vic was, like, saying your name about the bag. And then they'll be like, and then, like, it reminded me that she also said it to me when I was doing my campaign, and I didn't know she was just trying to say it, just get back to you. Uh, about what, specifically? About putting her in jail. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just say that, because uh, I did indicate to Beth, I, I said I said it without saying it, mm -hmm. that she would put her out. But I didn't say it, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But Beth got, Beth could read between the lines. That's not shut down. That's what I'm saying, should I be like, he did like mention that? Like, like don't, don't indicate to Beth that I, that I told you that I told her. Just oh, say no, that, no, no, just say that's what I told me. Yeah, yeah. like, yeah. And apparently, like, really, I was like, we brought the bag then. Yeah. And then he, like, mentioned that apparently, like, when Austin, him, Tina Tara were, like, in a room, like, she said that she was, like, really irritated about the bag. Yeah. And that, like, she fucking hates that shit and that she would put you guys out because of that or whatever. Like, I'll say something. Not because of that, but just put you guys out. Yeah. But you and Jen out. And I'll be like, and she just didn't say that to me, but I, like, didn't know she, like, wanted me to, like, say it back to you. Yeah. Perfect. Because she's saying it to other people, Perfect. and, like, that must be what she really wants. Yeah. Like, oh, that little sneaky, sneaky girl. And then you and I, or maybe me, I can go to Vic now because she's seen us yeah. talking five times. She keeps looking over yeah. me. Um, I'll just be like, look, I talked to Bray. Like, we all agree that the three of us need to be here. Yeah. And that's like our strongest path moving forward. Because yeah. we need, and just say, like, we need to make a big move. Mm -hmm. I'm going to reiterate to her that I talked to Beth and I didn't mention your name in the conversation. Didn't mention what? I'm going to tell her that I talked to Beth and I didn't mention your name in the conversation. Or maybe I won't say that, but I did tell her before. I was like, when I go talk to Beth, I'm not saying your name. Yeah. Because I need to reiterate to her because last time, obviously, with Kyle then. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe I'll go up there right now. Sure. No, go see Tina and Tara. What do I say to them? What do I say to them? Should I just pull Tina? Yeah. Or are you going to tell her that? Tara go crazy. Just, what's that? Just be like, are you going to tell her that you're, you're for sure that she's seen this well age wage? Yeah, I'd be like, that. Austin told me to yeah. come tell you that's required. Yeah. Like, if, in the event that yeah. she left. Yeah. yeah. She wanted me to let you guys know that, like, I can trust you. Yeah. She told me that I can trust you guys 100%. Yeah. That's that you guys have my back. Yeah. And that she wanted me to let you know that she was 99% sure yeah. that Vic was in this wage. Well like, here yeah. are all the reasons. Yeah. And then just like, and then I'll be like, and I just want you guys to know, like, I am, like, with you guys. Yeah. Like, I know, like, it might not always seem like it, but, like, yeah. I am. Yeah. And, like, if we have, like, any inklings or any, like, weird feelings, like, they'll just come talk to me. Yeah. Okay. I'll be like, I just don't want to make it, like, super awkward, like, obvious. Yeah. Because, like, if I go from not talking to you guys that yeah. often to yeah. chatting with you every single day, every yeah. single minute, yeah. make it look sus to the guys. Perfect. I think both of those conversations with her and with them are perfect. Okay. But should I just pull Tina and just talk to Tina? Sure. Or will that make Tara go? Well, they're both in the room, so we, they're both in the kitchen, so I don't know if it's going to look weird if you do that. That's how I'm thinking. Yeah, let's talk to Might as well just do it together. Yeah. I need to go pee, though.
What's up, babe? Okay. Oh, did you? Yeah, like I went in there and just kind of wanted to see what was up. How are you doing? Yeah. I just, so I just had a long chat with Brayden. Yeah. And I think we're all on the same page that the three of us need to be in this game because that's our best, that's our best chance. I'm so happy to hear this. So. What did you think? What did you say specifically? Um, and what about well, that? I kind of brought it up because you and I chatted this morning about yeah. it. Yeah. Um, just to say that we kind of need Vic in this game to move forward because obviously you're a strong player. And came to play, baby. She came to play. So I told him that, and I'm pretty sure he's on board. If you want my honest opinion, I'm pretty sure he's on board. I think we all think that the three of us need to be in this game. Go on so forward. wait, me? Fuck, that's still not enough votes to like, what are we gonna do about this week? You gotta win that veto? Basically. Okay. Basically, either I have to win the veto or you have to win yeah, the veto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or Brayden. Or Brayden. Okay. I, ho I just hope he means it. I think so. Because the good thing about this is that the good thing about Austin going home is that he doesn't have Austin attached at his hip anymore. No. And he can be his own player, and we can use that. Do you agree? I do, of course. Yeah, okay. that's what I was saying. I was actually trying to like hint that to him today, too. Okay. And we had this conversation. Of course, yeah, they're just gonna okay. pick us off. Yeah. Like, even when I was in there, the three of them, none of them bothered to leave. Like, mm -hmm. you know, it's just like. Yeah. Okay. I think that's, I honestly, I think that's best. Yeah. Okay. I couldn't agree more. Like, okay. I am not scared to take a big move. I'm gunning for it next yeah. week. Yeah. Gunning for this POV if I get picked. Okay. Like, it's not the, like, nitty gritty anymore. We're going into, like, look up. Look at what's happening already. Like I you know. look around, they're yeah. not. They don't consider their people. Yeah. They're gonna want to keep Tina and Tara because they're easier to beat in the end. Mm -hmm. it, that's these us three. Exactly. Where's Kiefer and all this? God damn it. That's what I don't know. So. I thought he was more on this side. If then you never know. I don't. I don't. So I gotta rely on your word for Keith because I, I, I just don't have the credibility. That you I do. know. I'm starting just starting to waver. Are you? Like I feel like he's still like good. Yeah. But like I think he kind of just goes where the power is. Like yeah. like you know yeah. like. Like, you know, like, like, I just don't see him voting against. Yeah. And that's not cool. What does that tell you? I need to talk to him alone. I haven't had a chat with him alone in a while. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. If you fucking go, we're fucked. I think so. Like, no, I know Not so. that I'm like this, like, but honestly, like, I, know so. I can be a little bit of a shield. In a way. And you're I'm a great a, competitor. I'm, I'm a, at this point, I've been on the block uh, three times, technically. Already, I'm an easy person to put up if I'm around. I think it's better for, for sure, you and Brayden. I do not want you to go. Like, not one yeah. part of my soul. Okay, perfect. Like, no, I need perfect. you here. I need you here to work with me to help me take a shot. Okay. Like, you know what I mean? Um, well, you know, I'm on board. I got nothing to lose at this point. I've been on my hands and knees this entire fucking game. I haven't had a week off. You know what I mean? That's fucked. Yeah. If I won next week, you would be having the best week of your life. Feasting. Feasting. Feasting, yeah. stress-free, chilling. Love that. Okay. Well, let's fucking do it then. How can we make this happen? Well, let's let's go through noms first and veto picks. And then after we have the veto picks, we let's... We can have a meeting? Yeah. Because I have a feeling everything's going to be tomorrow like last week. We'll do noms in the morning, veto picks, and then veto at night. Because veto's never not been on a Saturday. I'm seriously down. Okay. Sweet. It just has to stay discreet. Obviously, 100%. no one can know, but like we cannot roll over and die here. 100%. 100%. Yes, of course. Let's do Dude, this. This is our best shot. No, this is. If we don't fucking do this, mm -hmm. we're fucked. Like, I, I, me and Braden will be next. Mm -hmm. They're not going to go after them. No, Keep, chance. They're, not. they're going to Final Five. <sighs> Who wouldn't? Exactly. That's what I want. Like, you yeah, know what I mean? Exactly. But yeah, they would coast to Final Five easy, so. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. Okay, love this. Perfect. All right, you got me, man. Yeah, got you too. Okay.